Hi, it's Mary Kelsey. We're back here at the Whirling Thunder Kitchen. We're, today we're gonna make some um, colored pasta. This is a fun treat for children to prepare on their own as long as we can have the parents pre-cook the spaghetti. I'm gonna use bowls because I'm gonna show you kind of how we're gonna make this happen. So, you can always use the leftover spaghetti for a salad or something. Let's give it a good squirt, maybe about that much. This is our blue. This one here is gonna be green. This is the gel food coloring. It, it, gives, it gives your food a really deep coloring. So the pasta is cold because we want the children to prepare it and we're going to use a couple different flavoring, seasoning ideas. We can, it would work way better in a, um, a Ziploc bag so you wouldn't have to get your hands all blue. Not everybody has gloves at home, but we're going to get these stirred up. This one's green. You can always stir them with a spoon. I'm just using my hands because it just works easier for me. It's quicker. That one actually is a really pretty lime green. We're gonna move on. This one looks orange. It's supposed to be yellow. Okay, maybe I just use a little bit too much food coloring because we looks like we got orange Okay, that one's nice and stirred up. I'm just gonna use my same glove because this one's red and it's not gonna really matter. It's not gonna Interrupt the color Okay Okay, let's take a little bit from each color. It's just a different color. Tastes just like spaghetti noodles. That sure is colorful, looks pretty. I have a, a couple different ideas here for seasoning. Um, I don't know how many children are familiar with uh, pesto sauce, but I want um, people to try it. It's different, it's easy. Um, this is a good product to cook your chicken with. I preheated some um, butter. Um, a lot of children like, like butter on their pasta, you know, as they're growing into maybe preschool, they'll start using um, spaghetti sauce, but butter is always um, a, good, a good choice to flavor stuff for kids. And I use real butter because you know what real butter is made of. So that's kind of one of the ideas we have. And we're gonna use a little bit of um, Parmesan cheese. Get this opened up quick. And if you want to use spaghetti sauce, do it. That's fine. This is the pesto sauce that I wanted people to try. Mm, maybe not that much. I guess we're going to have to start out slow, especially for somebody who hasn't tried pesto sauce before. But um, it's a little different flavor. It's made with corn nuts, pine nuts, um, basil, a little bit of olive oil, and this can be made homemade. You can find 
recipes on the internet to make this pesto sauce homemade. And if I, no, that's gonna be kind of difficult to mix up, but we'll just give it a quick little stir like this. And um, it has a real um, Italian-y flavor. It's different, it's good. We wanna introduce new foods to our children so they can try new things and they're not afraid to try healthy choices for themselves. So those are a couple of um, recipes that is really fun that the kids might try, but just doing this part alone is a, an adventure in itself for kids and they would, um, you know, make it fun. Thanks for watching us here at the Whirling Thunder Wellness Kitchen. It's Mary Kelsey making really bright spaghetti for a healthy after-school treat for children that they can prepare themselves and have fun doing it.